Hey, what's going on, guys? It is your boy Megatron, and today I'm gonna to be bringing you guys a nice little commentary, I guess I have to say. But basically, right before I get into anything else, I do want to thank you for letting me post on your channel because there's not too many people out here these days that's letting people post on their channel, and I guess you know it's just not too many people that want to help out smaller channels, I guess I have to say. So there is a pleasure. Well, this is a pleasure for letting me post on your channel so really thank you just thank you but um before I get into anything else I do want to talk about the gameplay so basically in this gameplay it was a 58 and 6 gameplay yes that was pretty nice and that's obviously one of my best gameplays that I have ever gotten on Black Ops 2 and you know I feel it's an okay game at the moment but I'm gonna get into that later but you know like I said this is a 58 and 6 gameplay and it's very very nice I think you guys should pay attention to it I was using the MSMC which is a pretty pretty great gun you know, I, I advise you go try and use it. I do a series called Class of the Week, and that was one of the classes right there. And that was the gameplay I also used. But, you know, it's a pretty, pretty good class. I think you go try it out because I had the War Thog, the Stealth Chopper, and the Lightning Strike. And all those are my favorite most kill streaks in this game because, you know, they actually work great together. Like, the Stealth Chopper is a pretty good helicopter to use. It's like the attack helicopter from all the other Call of Duties. You know, it's pretty great, man. I'm telling you, it's pretty great. And the War Thog is just that awesome because I believe it swoops through the map at least four or five times dropping missiles and shooting guns like a gun chip type of a thing it goes pretty fast it's pretty awesome you guys should go try it out you know if you can't get high kill streaks I advise you to go try out the UAV the hailstorm missile and the lightning strike because those go well too with every class basically so basically I do want to say just a little bit about my channel just a little tense a bit you know what I'm saying so basically I'm 15 years old you know I post Call of Duty content on my channel, you know, that's where I started off at, so, you know, don't get mad that I post just that, you know, I'm gonna try to start doing a variety, a lot of people telling me to do a variety, but Black Ops 2 has recently came out, and, you know, most of my subscribers just wanna see it, because they don't have the game yet, so, that's basically what I'm trying to provide for my subscribers, is some Call of Duty Black Ops 2 gameplay, and I feel this game is awesome, but at the moment, you know, a lot of people are just going through it at this moment, because, you know, they're having skill-based matchmaking problems, and, you know, lag comp and freezing problems. I don't know if you're on PlayStation or Xbox, but I am on PlayStation. And, you know, the equipment I use is a Blue Yeti microphone. And I really feel this is a great mic. Let me know how the quality sounds. So, yeah, you know, I feel this is a pretty great mic. So, you should go try it out if you're a commentator as well. You know, I use a Windows computer, you know, just just the basics, you know what I'm saying? And like I said, I'm on PlayStation. You can add me, Bad Boy 2942 You know, I might be full. I'm sorry, but... You know, like I was saying, you know, I like posting a lot of Call of Duty content because that's basically where I started off at and, you know, where my subscribers subscribe to me at. So, if you like Call of Duty, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You know, hit that link on my channel and stuff like that. Hit that subscribe button. So, you know, as I was saying, you know, people are having you know, a lot of problems with Black Ops 2. You know, it's having freezing problems in this. Like I said, if you're on Xbox or PlayStation, I know PlayStation is having the most problems. And I am on PlayStation, like I said, and I am having horrible problems. But, you know, I just feel this game could be even better than what it is at the moment. Because we're having very a lot of troubles, actually. Just a lot of troubles with the game. And at the moment of me making this video, you know, they're talking about coming out with a patch to fix the game. But I don't know just yet about all of this stuff. You know, there's been rumors that the patch will come out. And, you know, I just can't wait on it because I spent $60 for this game. And, you know, I just had my hopes up too high thinking that this game could have been better than Black Ops 1. Which is my all-time favorite freaking Call of Duty was Black Ops 1. So, you know, I got my hopes up spending $60 pre-ordering all this crap. They took Nuketown out a while ago and added it back into a bonus mosh pit type of a thingy now and i just feel that's pretty stupid because i pre-ordered the game to play on nuketown whenever i wanted to you know what i'm saying so you know that's how i felt about that when that happened and like i said i po i paid sixty dollars for this game just to have fun and i thought i was gonna try to at least outbeat black ops one which is my favorite call of duty like i said i thought i was gonna try as best to outbeat it but you know from what i'm seeing right now it's it's not even in the making of trying to pass black ops one so you know, we're all having troubles with the game, and I'm pretty sure they will improve it and stuff like that. So, you know, I'm just I'm just going to... I got a lot of faith for it, is basically what I'm trying to say. I have too much faith for this game to already, you know, talk about it being hated. You know, I do have one video on my channel saying I hate Black Ops 2, but it's only because, you know, at the moment, I've been having too many, tr tr too many troubles, actually. And, you know, I don't really... I did not really expect this to happen to me when Black Ops come out. Because, you know, I'm an average Call of Duty player. My KD is around a 1.6 to 
to almost like a 1.8. It's getting up there. And, you know, I just wanted to have fun in this game. And it's it's putting me up against a lot of campers and tryhards that, you know, just wants to win as well, just like me. And, you know, and that never works out. So, you know, I paid too much money to not, not you know, get the features that I wanted. So, you know, that's just one thing I'm having trouble with in Black Ops. And, you know, I know in the near future they're going to come out and, you know, improve this game. So, you know, I'm not going to say too, too much about that. But, you know, I want to say the stuff that I do like about the game, which are the kill streaks and how they set up the objective based plan crap in this game, where if you play the objective, you will get, you know, rewards, you rewarded for it. And I know the my favorite freaking game mode that helps you get rewarded in objective is hard point and that's a lot of that's a lot of you know objective based gaming right there and a lot of people like that as well and basically they had the score streak system which is pretty good so when you play the objective on hard point you know get a hard point kill like around the area it's basically like headquarters so if you get a hard point kill around there you know that's a lot of objective based points and right there going on to your score streak so you know I feel that's pretty good that they implemented that into the game because you know that is a good thing to use and their guns are pretty it's pretty good uh, so if you don't have it just go try it out man just give it a try you know what I'm saying I can't even explain it right here because I'm just too excited I'm on my man's channel so you know that's pretty much all I did want to say so if you did enjoy this commentary please come check me out on my channel like I said I post a nice amount of Call of Duty content over there but you know sooner or later this gameplay is going to be wrapping up in a couple seconds so you know I just want to thank you one more time for letting me post on your channel man I really had the time of my life the time of my life you know so um like I said, if you did enjoy, please leave a like on this video. You know, subscribe to him if you haven't already. And please subscribe to me if you enjoyed this. So, I guess I'm going to end it right here. So, your boy Megatron is out. Peace.